welcome to Sach Media. So today we are going to give, do a very deep, no, very easy recipe. Anybody can do this under 15 minutes. Yes, I said 15 minutes. So uh, those who like fish, please try this recipe. Okay, so now let's get into the ingredients. All right, so for today, uh, the fish we have taken is salmon, uh, which is rich in omega-3 fatty acids and so many good things about this. All right, so this is here. And now here are usual masalas. Turmeric powder, one tablespoon, one tablespoon, red chili powder, then one tablespoon, black pepper powder, then salt, then a piece of lemon. <laughs> then, all right, so this is very easy recipe, but it's never compromising on any nutritional value. So we have taken some broccoli here. All right. So this one, after cooking, you can have it with rice or chapati, whatever it's available. Uh, then so carbs is there. Then protein, very rich protein will be there. Then vegetables, everything. So this is actually a balanced, uh, you know, meal. So please, let's get into cooking. Okay, now let's get started. So first of all, let's mix these masalas. Yes, everything combined well. Now take a slice of fish, then put it on top. Just mix it nicely. Sometimes the store-bought salmons, it will be salted. So make sure, you know, try to read or something. And um, if it's salted, uh, add less salt. If it is not, add just regular uh, amount. Okay, and mix it, cut it nicely. If you like ginger garlic paste, ginger garlic taste a lot, you can also add uh, ginger garlic paste into this. It will also taste good. It depends on people, you know. Some people like it that way. Some people do not. <laughs> okay, so this is ready. If you want, you can rest this for uh, 5 minutes or 10 minutes, but I'm going to make it now. Okay, once the pan is hot, lower the flame and add enough coconut oil. Just enough. Maybe I have added one tablespoon probably. That's it. And now one and wait for like five seconds. Make it hot. Then add salmon into this. I'm just putting two pieces now. Yeah, and close it. Because if you open it, if you keep it open, uh, the it can get hard. So keep it closed for five minutes. Uh, not five minutes, seven minutes. Seven. On. And keep it closed until uh, that time. And after that, we'll flip it over and we'll add the broccoli. Okay. Okay, so seven minutes over. Now it's time to open. Pan. Okay, this is how it looks now. Now it's time to flip it over. Okay. Okay. Now you can um, keep it for five more minutes. So meantime, I'm adding these broccoli here. Because broccoli is cooked very easily, so we do not have to cook it separately. Um, I do love this. So, uh, keep it there for 5 minutes. So, by that time, the fish and the broccoli will be ready. Always remember to cover it. Because it's it makes a lot of difference when you cover uh, and, you know, without covering. So, this for this recipe, always make sure you cover it. Okay? Now, um, let's see after 5 minutes. Okay, now it's time. Open. It looks perfectly cooked. Switch off the flame. Now. Time to take this out. To the serving dish. Okay. It's 
perfectly cooked and all the broccoli in the mix. It's ready. Now it's time to add lemon to our easy peasy lemon squeezy recipe. I'm squeezing the lemon. Yes, this is fine. The final product. Okay, so this is the final product. Uh, please have it with rice or chapati, whatever your choice is. So thank you so much for watching. Um, let us know how it uh, turns out. Bye.